What's up, guys? Welcome back to Andy's Hot Diecast Garage. Um, today we have a Spin Master Monch Jam uh, Reveal the Steel 2-pack. And this is, of course, the Avenger S10 body style versus the uh, Wonder Woman. And uh, I have the camera on Avenger because it's just so awesome looking. So there's a little bit of the card art. This is a little big for my uh, studio right here. So, uh, I apologize for that, but there's Wonder Woman, if you guys can see that. There's that. And, uh, so, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take this out of the package, and then I'm gonna show you what it looks like, uh, in normal form, and then I'm gonna reveal the steel, um, and we'll see what it looks like. So, let me get, get this unboxed, so I'll show you guys unbox it. Alright, so let's open this up. Alright guys, sorry for that little shake of the camera, but let's continue opening up these awesome cars, or trucks, Monster Jam trucks. First time getting a Spin Master Avenger, I do have, which I didn't bring it out, which I should have, I do have a Hot Wheels Avenger. I didn't think to bring it out, but oh well. Ooh, Wonder Woman looks pretty cool. Oh, wow, look at that Avenger. All right, actually, in here, nothing inside of this, but there, it has, like, logos on it. It has the Avenger and the Wonder Woman, so that's pretty cool. So, just one more quick look. And... There's the Avenger logo. Looks really cool. The skull. Love Avenger. Avenger's one of my favorite trucks. Alright. So let's take that out. Alright, so first we'll review Wonder Woman. So here's the Wonder Woman. The, um, I like the red on it. I think the red, all the red is going to transform into uh, steel. I think all the red washes off. Um, and surprisingly, you guys would think that maybe it was a different feeling paint from the main lines. Well, it's kind of, it's actually not kind of like a different paint. It feels like the same paint as in the uh, singles packs that don't turn uh, steel. But you got your see-through uh, gold rim. You got your roll cage, transparent roll cage. You have the, f and then I like the top, the color of the top. Uh, there's the engine back there. I'm not sure what this little piece is around the, the bed of the truck. Hmm? Um, I guess this is like her rope around the bed of the truck. I like the tires. And I like I love the gold rim. The gold rims. It looks pretty cool. And like I said, the red's probably gonna turn steel. Uh, if you can see right there. And uh this is the least favorite of the two pack. But let me show you what's the highlight of the pack. This guy right here. The Avenger, and this thing is awesome. So it's got the like the see-through gray in the middle. It's got a really uh, bright lime green roll cage with the green paint. It's got. All right, let's start from here. It actually has the printed-in grill. Look at that! I love that. The printed and grill on there. This is the Chevy S10 body style. Um, I really urge uh, Spin Master to make the Chevy Bel Air casting. I have one of those in Hot Wheels. Um, I should have brought it out, but again, I didn't really bring it out. But yeah, I, I think they should definitely make the uh, Chevy Bel Air. We'll look at the decal on the top last because that's my favorite decal on the whole truck. But there's the side. Has the skull with the flames. 
You can see the driver in there. I love this green. Going on the back, you have Lucas Oil. One of my favorite oil sponsors. Anything in Lucas Oil livery, I have to pick it up. And on the top, that's my favorite decal. It has uh, Lucas Oil. The big Lucas Oil lettering. So, now I'm going to put each one of these in the warm water. And show you what they look like uh, with the Reveal the Steel version. So, give me just a second. I'll be right back. Alright, we uh, got um, Wonder Woman. Here she is. And like I said, the red did change into chrome. You look around the truck. It's the front. It's all chromed out. Reveal the steel. There you go. I'm going to just shake it a little more. Okay. And here's the back. And uh, looks pretty cool. So now we're going to get Avenger and reveal the steel form. So let's go ahead and shake him off. And here he is. Really cool looking. Lucas Oil Avenger chromed out. All right, that's is a very cool truck. It has the whole body is now chrome. And uh, after I get done showing you, you uh, this one, I'm gonna change it back for you guys. And there's the Lucas Oil on the top against that uh, silver kind of. And um, Lucas Oil on the back against the silver tailgate. And again, those gray rims. So, let me get them back to the original state. And uh, give me just a second. All right, so we got a piece of uh, ice. So, we're going to bring it in. And let's turn it back. Hopefully it turns back sooner than later. Okay. Let's get it back. Starting to see some red. It's definitely coming back, guys. She is definitely coming back. Let me do the rest off camera here so I can. All right, so we got it all the way back again. There's the Wonder Woman. There's that side. There's the back. There's the top. And here's the one I really love. The Avenger. He is back in his original iconic Avenger green. Well, it's not Avenger green. They, they didn't make a custom green, shade of green for Avenger. It's just like a light lime green. But there he is. There's that side with the flames and the skull. There's the back and there's the top with my Lucas Oil Crusader, my favorite uh, decal. So, that is the uh, Spin Master Monster Jam Reveal the Steel Mix 7 uh, assortment. Uh, that's uh, the two-pack with the um, Wonder Woman and the Avenger. So, let me know in the comments down below what you think of uh, these. I really like the Avenger. I, uh, that Avenger is really, really cool, especially in uh, Reveal the Steel form. So, um, and it'll definitely be in some tournaments since it's my first Spin Master Avenger. So please like and subscribe to my channel, Andy's Hot Diecast Garage. And um, thank you so much for watching. And also go check out my Facebook and uh, Instagram page as well. 
and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.